I'm going to practice decision making for Japanese Mahjong, also known as Riti. If you're new to this version, look for a link below the video for a player reference with the scoring elements in it. This way, you can follow along as I make decisions with some random pulls. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. We're going to alternate each random pull between East Round and South Round. We're going to do six. Let's see how it goes. I'm going to roll these dice just to randomize which seat we might be in, in a game. I rolled a five, so that would be one, two, three, four, five the dealer. So we'll just say that we're the dealer for this first random pull. Eight dot will be Dora. We have Dora. I would build around that. So I think what I would probably do is play Pone of Dragon. That's called Yakuhai. That's a Yaku, so we could win with that alone. We've got to come up with four blocks and a pair, though. So if that's one, we could potentially use this as a three in a sequence. That's called a Chi. And that way, too, we can utilize Dora. We would need to draw in tiles to make either a pone or Chi out of these. Here's a potential Chi right there. So here we would have one, two, three blocks. We'd need two more. So these are isolated. Yeah, this is going to take some work. But between Dora and Yakuhai, that's two Han. It's east round, and we're in east seat. So neither of these will bring any score. So I think what I would probably do is discard these two first. Chi here to use Dora, Chi here for a block, and then hopefully draw in another Chi. Shoot for Yakuhai and Dora. It would be a low score hand, but a quick win, potentially. Okay, we're going to go on to South Round. Random pull two. This time, let's say we are two, four, six in south seat. So six crack is Dora this time. We do have Dora right there. All single honors here. We do have a pair. You always have to have a pair. These are isolated. There's a potential chi using Dora or a potential chi here leaving Dora isolated and then two isolated tiles. So let's see if we're in south seat and it's south round that could potentially bring some score. Since we have mixed suits, including a pair, I think I would probably get rid of these single honors. Maybe discard these two first to see if we could pair these up, because both of these could be a Yaku. A pone, any Pone of Dragons is a Yaku, and a Pone of your seat wind or the wind of the round, that could also be a Yaku. Uh, a Yaku. So I think I would throw those last, but discard these first and see about playing what's called Pinfu. Pinfu is all cheese, all three in a sequence. We would need to draw pretty well because we have a pair and one potential chi right here using Dora. But I think that's probably what I would do here since these are all singles and we have mixed suits, including Dora and a pair in different suits. Discard those first. Shoot for Pinfu unless those pair up. 
Okay, let's go to the next one. Back to East Round. This time, we're going to be North Seat. The progression for winds with Dora is east, south, west, north, back to east. So east is Dora. One way you can remember that is to say eat soup with nuts. East, south, west, north. Since we have only one single honor, I would play Pinfu. Leverage all those number tiles. So Pinfu is three in a sequence, like this right here. One, two, three. So we have one, here's a potential, seven, eight, nine, a pair, potential, seven, eight, nine, and a potential, three, four, five, or four, five, six. The thing about this particular potential chi is it's called a side weight, where you need either a two or a five to complete it. For Pinfu, that is the required weight. So we would have to complete these before this one or be left with another side weight. This is called a closed weight where we're waiting on the tile in the middle. This one is called an edge weight where we're waiting on this tile on the side to complete it. So I would try for Pinfu here. We have one, two, three, four, five blocks, all ready to complete. Let's see, there's no Dora. We've got mixed suits. We do have a terminal, terminal, terminal. Terminals are ones and nines. There is a Yaku called June Chan, I believe. June Chan, terminals in all. But we'd have to nix this and go with a 2 3. So I think it's too far. There is a little bit of a pattern there, but I think I would leverage the fact that these are ready to go and play just Pinfu. Pinfu alone and Ricci. Since Pinfu is a concealed hand, you could also declare Ricci. So Pinfu and Ricci here. Back to South Round. Random pull four. This time, let's say we're in West Seat. West Seat, South Round. Four band will be Dora. Mixed suits, two single honors. I would discard those and play Pinfu again. Here we have a pair. These are isolated. We do have a pair here too. I would still try for Pinfu. If we continue to pair up, we could play all pwn, which is all three of a kind, but with only two, I would not try to pwn these until I had at least four pair. So I would try to play Pinfu here. We do have the suit with Dora, but a one, two, three, or two, three, four, that would be the only way to use these with Dora. So I don't know if Dora will come into play here, but we only have two honors, so maybe we could draw in some number tiles to help complete cheese in this particular random pull. Pinfu and Ricci. 
random pull five back to east round this time let's say we're going to be north seat Two dot is Dora. No honors, all number tiles. We have one pair. So I think I would try Pinfu and Ricci again. And we do have a potential to use Dora with a three four. There's a seven eight nine or eight, nine, six, seven, two potential chis. This is isolated, isolated. There's a potential chi, and here's a potential chi, and then a pair. So that's one, two, three, four, five blocks. That's all you need. We have side weight, side weight, side weight. This is a pretty good start for Pinfu and Ricci, and maybe even Dora. That's how I play this one. Pinfu Ricci Dora. You know what I was thinking? Maybe even try for Tanyao. Tanyao is called also all simples, all numbers two through eight. That would take away a potential um, a potential chi though and we would be taken down to only four blocks one two three four so we would need to draw in more chi tiles for these here maybe discard the nine crack first and see what happens but I think that's a possibility that would be another Yaku Tanyao Pinfu and Ricci that would be three Yaku but Pinfu and Ricci Still, that's two. You only need one to qualify. Throw this away first. Last one. Back to south round. This time we'll be in west seat. One Bam is Dora. No door. Oh, there's Dora right there. So what I would do here, leverage Dora, get rid of those single honors and play Pinfu. Here's a pair. Got to have a pair. Since Dora is a one, I would not try for Tanyao. I would leverage Dora. So there's a potential chi. Here's a chi right there. And we do have a three. There's a bit of a, a pattern of the same chi in three suits. That is called Sanshoku Dojun. Mixed triple chi. We would need a one and a two, of course. I would just play this out for Pinfu and Ricci, see if Sanshoku comes in and get rid of those two. Leveraging Dora. A few of those were really promising. Only the winner gets paid though, so don't be tempted to go for either big yaku or too many yaku you want to be the first one to a winning hand. if you like this video give me a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed to my channel consider subscribing click that little gray bell if you do that way you'll get notification for when i post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table between now and the next set of random pulls for japanese mahjong also known as richi May all your picks be keepers.